This arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says a five gallon aquarium has a length of 16 inches, a width of eight inches, and a height of 10 inches. If a hose can fill the aquarium with water at a rate of 160 cubic inches per minute, how long will it take to completely fill the aquarium? So the first thing we have to figure out is the volume of water that's gonna be in the aquarium when it's full. And it's a rectangular prism, so its volume is simply going to be length times width times height. Again, on the ASVAB and PyCat, you're not given a calculator or reference sheet, so you do have to commit some of these basic formulas from geometry to memory. Well, according to this problem, the aquarium has a length of 16, a width of 8, and a height of 10. So all we're going to do is multiply these three things together. If you want to do it the easy way, you could do... 16 times 10, which is going to be uh, 160 times 8. And I'm going to do this part off to the side so as not to make any uh, simple mistakes here. We have 160 times 8. 0 times 8 is 0. Uh, 6 times 8 is going to be 48, so carry a 4. 1 times 8 is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So the volume of this 5-gallon aquarium is 1,280 uh, cubic inches. Now, according to the problem, uh, this hose can fill the aquarium at a rate of 160 cubic inches per minute. So to find how long it's going to take to completely fill the aquarium, we're going to do 1,280 divided by 160. Of course, we're going to cross out these units, and we're also going to cross out these corresponding zeros to make this 128 over 16. And based on our answer choices, we know that 128 divided by 16 is going to be an even number. Uh, if this was 20 times 5, it would be too small. So I'm going to say 5 and 6 are too small. And I'm going to take a gamble and say 16 times 8 is exactly 128. Uh, 6 times 8 is 48, carry a 4. Uh, 1 times 8 is 8, plus 4 is 12. So 16 times 8 is exactly 128 with no remainder. In other words, it's going to take the hose 8 minutes to fill the aquarium uh, if it fills it at a rate of 160 cubic inches per minute. So this one is D, of course.